Hey everyone, in this quick tech how-to video, I'm going to show you how to enable TPM 2.0 on Windows. TPM 2.0 is required if you want to install Windows 11. It's pretty simple to turn on, but it varies depending on your motherboard manufacturer. I'm using an Asus Republic of Gamers motherboard with an Intel processor. To enable TPM, first I need to restart my PC using Advanced Startup. One simple way to do this is to click on the Windows icon located at the bottom left of your start bar. Then, click on the power icon. Now, hold shift and click on restart. In the advanced startup menu, select troubleshoot. On the next screen, select advanced options. Then, select UEFI firmware settings. Finally, to change the UEFI firmware settings, select restart. Once you've rebooted, you should be at the BIOS settings screen. For this motherboard, I'm going to click on Advanced, then click on PCHFW Configuration, then in the drop down menu on the right, I'm going to select Enable. A notice will show up on the screen explaining a little more about TPM 2.0. Click OK once you've read the notification. Then press F10 to save the changes and exit. Each motherboard is slightly different. For AMD motherboards, navigate to Security, then Trusted Computing, then select AMD FTPM Switch. Those options should cover most cases and hopefully get you on your way to enabling TPM 2.0. If this was helpful, click the like and subscribe buttons. We have more helpful Quick Tech how-to videos coming your way.